All right, we have some breaking news now we need to tell you about. A Columbia apartment complex is heavily damaged after a fire this afternoon. This happened at the Hampton Green Apartments located on Gills Creek Parkway just down the road from WLTX. Our News 19's Eleanor Tabone joins us live now where firefighters are still on the scene. Eleanor, what's the latest there? That's right, Andrea. I am here at Hampton Green Apartments and I want to show you the damage that is incurred here at these apartments. Now, according to the fire department, about eight units suffered damage here, four severely damaged by fire, four damaged by smoke. And as we show you, firefighters are still assessing the scene. There are dozens of firefighters here still working to clear the scene. And we do have Fire Chief Aubrey Jenkins with us. Chief, Tell me a little bit about the fire. Do you know how it started? Right now, we're not sure how this fire started. It's time we do have my investigator on the scene. Uh, he's taking a look at it, walking through it, just trying to figure out how this fire started. Was anyone home at the time of this fire? Were there any injuries? Uh, no, right now we had no reported injuries at this time, and we don't believe that anybody was here when the fire started. Chief, it, it looks very badly damaged. How much money are we costing that it could take to repair these, these units? We probably get somewhere around between three hundred to four hundred thousand dollars in damages. And the people that do stay in these buildings, what's going to happen to them as you continue their investigation and they wait for it to be repaired? Well, you know, in talking with the uh, management, they uh, possibly can put some of them up. We also call on Red Cross to assist. So between them and Red Cross, you know, uh, they have some place to go. And as this investigation continues, what will be happening the rest of the afternoon here at the Hampton Green Apartments? Well, basically, we're just going to make sure that we got all the hot spots out. Uh, once we complete our investigation, then we'll turn it back over to the management. Thanks, Chief. I appreciate your time. Sure. Back to you in the studio. Eleanor Tabone reporting for us live. Eleanor, thank you so much. Of course, we'll have more for you as they continue to fight that fire and the recovery process for uh, for those who were living there a little bit later in our newscast.